Welcome to gray on math. We are asked to solve this problem. We have a square and inside the square is a triangle with an area of 18 square units and beside this adjacent to this triangle is another triangle which is a right triangle and we are required to find the length of the leg A and Okay, so first thing that we have to do is we need to draw a line from this 90 degree, degree angle downwards. And we already labeled this as A and this leg, we label this as B. And next we label the side of the square as S. So S, S, S and S. So, using the altitude and hypotenuse theorem, this will give us this length is actually A square over S. Okay, so to prove that this length is actually A square over S, so we have set the first triangle as one leg, the shorter leg is B, and the longer leg is A, and the hypotenuse is S. And next is, we make another triangle with hypotenuse as A, and this length is actually an unknown, though, so let us call that as X. And we uh, get the ratio of this since this is the adjacent over the hypotenuse, this angle. So this should be also theta because they are similar triangles. Then we have A over S uh, adjacent over the hypotenuse is equal to X over the hypotenuse, which is A. So X is actually equal to if we cross multiply we have a square over s so that length is actually a square over s okay so next thing that we have to do is we need to use the formula for the area so the area of the triangle is 18 and that is equal to one half times the base which is s and the height is equal to this height and this is parallel to a square over s and of course it is congruent to a square over s so a square over s okay so we cancel this s and we cross multiply 2 times 18 so we have 36 is equal to a square so if we get the square root of both sides then we have a is equal to 6 and the value of A is 6 units and this is our answer so thank you for watching until the end of the video please like the video if you like our solution and don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon so you will be updated for more math videos like this thank you bye